Today I want to share with you how I'm going to upgrade the upper grommets on these Allen Edmund Daltons to speed hooks. First step is to work loose the grommets. Uh, they're folded over on the back side of the boot and these pedals can be lifted up one by one. Uh, it is pretty time consuming, but I work through them. I think if you didn't mind destroying them, you could probably take them out with a drill bit, maybe a countersink bit or something like that. But I actually had intended to reuse them for another project possibly. So they're a little mangled, but uh, as you can see, I work them out with the pliers, push them out. Uh, later in the video, I actually find it's easier to pop them out the backside with a pair of side cutters rather than the pliers. Uh, but overall, not too bad to get them out. This tool is special for speed hooks. You can see it's got a gap that allows the speed hook to drop in. I believe I found it on uh, eBay, but it may have been on Amazon. They were not available at any of my regular leather retailers like Tandy, so I kind of had to search around to find it in the grommets. Once you have the speed hook in the setter, you can uh, push it through the hole in the boot. You wanna make sure you have the hook facing the right way while you do this. Uh, next is to put a small washer on the back side of it. You can see one side of the washer's concave, one's convex. I put the concave side up so that as I peened the back of the rivet over, it would mushroom out into that concavity and hold the boot better. I'm not positive that's right, but I believe it is. I'm not sure you can make it out in the video, but as you're setting these rivets, you can hear a tone change that your hammer blows that tells you once uh, you've got it all the way on. You wanna make sure that when you wiggle the hook, it's fairly tight. Um, it may not be possible to keep them from spinning at all, but you can certainly get them pretty snug in the leather. Here I finally get smart and use the side cutters to pry these out. I'm not cutting the rivet, just using it as a lever arm. Uh, one thing that always annoyed me about these boots is the way they were bar laced. They were difficult to pull tight and you had to work the laces up. As you can see with the speed hooks and the top two hooks, much easier, yet they still have the classic bar lacing when the pants are down. 